Hey, what's up? I'm Michelle B and today I am addressing the question Is it normal slash like okay to go braless? I actually googled this question and the first thing that came up was 12 times that it is okay to go braless Including but not limited to when you're getting ready in the morning when wearing a buttoned up jean jacket <laughs> To clear this article up I would just like to quickly point out to the writers of this article that you can actually go braless at any point in time whenever you want Legitimately, if you feel the urge to not wear a bra, you can go ahead and not wear that bra. It may not be like societally normal to go braless, but it is certainly okay to go braless whenever you want, no matter the size or shape of your boobs. The thing with bras is the only things that they're actually good at doing is like, A, they keep your boobs in place, like when you're running or you just have generally big boobs that kind of need to be kept in place. And B, sometimes they look really nice, like nice bralettes, for love and lemons, and all two of those functions are like super useful don't get me wrong but they don't really add up to bras being like a necessary part of your daily routine slash life and there are actually a lot of things that bras are not really that good at doing like for instance being comfortable I own like 15 bras and I think that one maybe two of them are comfy secondly being affordable. Bras are not affordable. <laughs> Bras are very expensive. They're the kind of things that you just like let other people buy you because it's hard to justify spending $50 on such a small piece of material that covers such a small area that so few people actually see. Thirdly, they're bad at generally suiting outfits. Nearly like every time that I go to wear my white t-shirt, I end up having put on a pink or like lacy bra that you can completely see through the t-shirt. Fourthly, bras don't last long. Considering the $50 price tag, it is very easy for an underwire to pop out, elastic getting all not elasticy. Fifthly, fifthly, is that a thing? Lastly, bras are really bad at allowing girls to stop thinking that they have to conform to the societal standard of incredibly perky round boobs. Super perky boobs are fabulous. Relaxed boobs are also fabulous. D cup boobs are great. A cup boobs are also great. Boobs that point in different directions, love it. Perky and pushed up boobs are not the only and best kind of boobs to have. So this video in summary, wearing a backless top to a party and cannot find a bra that doesn't make your outfit look freaking awful. Maybe you should consider not wearing a bra. Going to Aldi on a Netflix and cup of tea kind of day and really cannot be bothered to put on a bra. If you don't really feel like wearing a bra, and you feel comfortable not wearing a bra, then don't wear a bra. Kind of like despise wearing bras in general. Contemplate the idea of not wearing bras as a whole. Feel like you are in complete and utter disagreement with all of my points and freaking love wearing bras that think that they're super cute and make your boobs look amazing. Also excellent, wear your bra with pride. So I hope that you dug this video. This question has come up in random topics just like across the board in my life so I was like I'm gonna make a video about this. It's like semi fashion related so I thought that you guys might be into it. I kind of want to know like how you guys feel about bras. I know a lot of people are very pro bra especially people that have bigger boobs obviously makes sense but lately I don't know I have been feeling not wearing a bra. I've been feeling you know free the nipple, free boobin. I'd actually really like to know your thoughts. I know you're all you know you're onto it, you know what's up. I'm sick. <laughs> Subscribe to my channel if you have not already and follow me on Instagram, like me on Facebook, all the rest. And I will see you soon. These are 100% eyelash extensions, FYI. And they kind of go like everywhere. It's like... Thanks for watching.